Hello, Tomek. Hello. <laughs> so, hey guys, Jarek here, and welcome to Amberscape. As always, this is Saturday, and I have few three hours to look for fossils because there is the only time uh, in the week when I can go for adventures, you know? So, I was at this river before, uh, I was here before I went on my holidays to Portugal. I did found uh, some of the corals here, I will show it to you right now. In this picture you can see three big pieces of corals. One of them is Favocytes coral and two of them is chain corals. And these chain corals I'm still keeping for vinegar prep. And let's see if today maybe I will have a little bit more time to check more places and maybe we can find something more than before. It's always lag based, so let's see what can we get. Absolutely empty. So, few destroyed rocks, and we have first nice shell, guys. This is very nice brachiopod. In fact, two of them in here. You can see this big one? Very complete. I will take it. So, Tommy, what did you find? Did you find the Singapore? He sure did. Let's take a look, guys. <laughs> Where did I drop it? There it is. This is uh, colonial coral, guys. It's named Seringopora. Let me clean it a bit. There we go. Quite weathered, but it's nice. Good job, Tomek. <laughs> you really need to get used to see patterns to find some fossils amongst all of these rocks. And each time you find a fossil, it feels like a small win and keeps you moving forward, wanting for more. You see it? I wonder what kind of coral it is. Is it Favocytes? Probably. Yeah, it's tabloid coral colonial from the Silurian period. Not so pretty, but for now, for now, I'll also take it. it has quite nice patterns. The block of concretion looks quite promising. Let's take it out and look for signs if there's anything sticking out. I will try to wash it. Not sure, I don't see anything so far, but let's try to open it anyway, across here. More often than not, the rocks contains nothing inside. But that does not discourage me, because failures are the road to success, and without trying to smack them, I won't find anything. You see these guys? It's very weathered, big chunk of coral. Not sure what kind of coral though. Yeah, for sure, definitely. See all those patterns? Hmm. I don't think it's rugosa, guys. Or I'm not sure. I will leave a caption of what it is. Yeah, guys, uh, so far nothing crazy, a few corals, a uh, few bigger pieces of corals, but nothing in complete sh shape, only some bro broken pieces. So, <laughs> let's continue, there is nothing more to say. Whoop, what, I see a concretion. No, probably nothing. Do 
you see it, guys? Look at this baby. It's another chain coral. This is very similar location from the last one which I found. Look, it's the size of my palm, the colony of this uh, Heliocytes chain coral. Very nice patterns. This is, very, this is very fortunate, guys. I will tell you why. From all the hunting, I'm collecting all the chain corals I can find because I want to make a preparation video with vinegar for them. This is the coral which cleans very nicely with vinegar and can look amazing when prepped. And now, finally, I have enough of them to make a video. So the next one is the preparation video for the chain corals. He's also working hard, but he didn't bring any hammer. <laughs> Instead of getting one from me, he is just using his hands. As expected, this is turning out to be a coral day because I see another one, guys. <laughs> this is some coral, guys. You see it? Uh, look at these patterns, pretty nice sun coral. Obviously I will take it home. Even if I won't take into consideration the amount of fun I'm having while fossil hunting, I really enjoy just these landscapes. This is very beautiful place. Yeah, so at this place I found another Syringopora, but it's not weathered at all. I can see some patterns only from the top. So I guess it will also go into acid. Yo, I found another one. And it's not weathered, it's sun coral. And it's gorgeous, guys. Be barely any patterns, right? Well, that's because it's not weathered at all. Now we can see it some. Yeah, this is also some coral, guys. And science, it's not weathered at all. I will move it into vinegar also for the fossil prep video. Quite a huge block, guys. Yep, there is a uh, end of the river right here. So, <laughs> this is the time to say goodbye and let's see what did we manage to find at this trip. And this is my today's finds. And as always, a bunch of corals, but that's not bad because I need them for my next video, guys. And this hiking was a really pleasant experience, the river is very nice. And my trip maker is this nice chain coral, I hope it will survive the preparation with the vinegar. There is some closer look on it. And now I will show you the all the chain corals I have prepared for the next video and other corals. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, consider subscribing to my channel and liking this video. And see you next time. Bye!